What's up, everybody? It's Rejuvenate here. I'm bringing you another Division in Depth video today. We're going to be going over the house, not the house, <laughs> the heel in depth. Now, it's called, there's also known as the Devil's Heel, but I don't got the Devil. So, there's the Devil and the Heel. These are both exotic marksman rifles. They are both semi auto. Let's see in here. So this loads. We'll go over the devil's traits real quickly. Even though I don't have it, I do have no time. So weapon talents for our for the in general are gonna be fire and fury. Fire is gonna be on the devil. And fury is going to be on the heel. What fire does is headshots increase stability by 30% for 15 seconds. Body shots in body shots increase headshot damage by 15 by 30% for 15 seconds. Heal's exclusive talent is fury. Hitting weak points is increased. Increases the weapon's damage by 15% for 15 seconds. Hitting skill proxies. Increase critical hit damage for by 30% for 15 seconds. Now if we go down, if we have both the guns, which I don't, it unlocks the talent, the devil's heal. Both weapon gain fury and fire talents, and the buff durations are increased by 15 seconds. Bonuses from the fury and fire no longer last when swapping between are no longer. Are no longer last when swapping between fire and fury. Weapon speed is increased. Base damage for this bad boy the heal is lucky for me. I got one that would drop at 75, uh, 277, and the damage dropped at 75.2k. Rounds per minute is 275, and the magazine is 15. This has the same stats almost as the. Police MK17 or a. I can read it. I don't have one here anymore. Or is the there is SOCOM MK20 SSR? Are the very two? Those are the brothers of it. That gun basically. This design was after a M4. You are now Thanks, I think I can't tell. Designs are off of an M4. And I'm going to show you this whole mission of what this gun can really do only using the heal so let's get into it oh what the fuck Later on today, I'm going to be doing a division run video to show you how to get the most out of the dark zone for your division tech. We've got a lot of hostiles inside, Agent. They're holding Dr. Candle and her staff. We need those personnel back at the base so we can get the medical wing from Alright. I'm actually just probably not going to be that good. I haven't played it all today. Now the build I would recommend with this is going to be your Hunter's Faith. Hold on a second, I can't. So I was going to do it all bad, but I'm just getting overrun right now. Hold on. It's rather difficult when you're by yourself. Die, you bitch. There we go. Okay. I think there's I another gear piece. No defense. Pretty sure it's just Hunter Fates. That's everyone's using with the snipers. 
But if you have Hunter's Faith, you know, I'll tell you exactly what gear set it is. We gotta look it up in our handy dandy notes. Come on, load it up. All right. Sensories call. Sensories call is another one that people are using as well, but majority of what you see on these builds are going to be uh, higher space. Dead Eye and Sentry's Call. Dead Eye is the one that the majority of the people run for these, though, just because you get the 40% initial bullet stability, 20% marksman rifle, crit hit damage, and then your talent when zoomed in, marksman rifle loses headshot. Headshot bonus begins 50% critical hit chance while out of cover, and 100% critical hit chance while in cover. Uh, for your bonus piece 5, you get 80% basically, so 40, another 40 for bullet stability, and then your marksman rifle can, uh, critical hit damage is going to be at 20%, and then same thing, but it'll last longer, and it'll be increased instead of by 50, by 20, when zoomed in to the maximum of 100%, will increase the stability by 110 seconds. Can you see the CCTV or screen? until no longer like and her so staff are being if you have the classified for that you're pretty much golden with a marching rifle right me I'm I'm slacking okay I need the classified so the classified I have like is my up bridge there's a lot of these guys oh, there's a lot of these guys them, shut up hey wow where the hell is the settings I'm gonna go turn down that shit mute Perfect. I no longer have to listen to Isaac. They allow it's it's great. It's like playing Destiny and the ghost just never shuts up. It's like we don't, don't need your additional commentary. Shut up. This gun's an absolute beast. You probably just heard my controller it just vibrate beyond belief, too. Let me know down in the comments what guns you guys use or would like to see an in depth on. Mind you, I probably picked the, one of the worst versions of the uh, exotic studio. Because the heal, it's a sniper. If you don't really have a sniper build, it's not going to work the best out for you. That's the nice thing about the Alpha Bridge, that tech, that tactical buff for your electronic area. My boy up there, Mr. Power Plant. This gun's beastly. Cypher Free. Oh shit. Okay. Let's just blow through this mission. This is taking way too long. Be in depth. I mean, it's it's good, easy. The marksman rifles in this game are super easy to use, but everyone's running a stupid Cronus Max or Max Cronus, whatever the fuck that thing's called. If you use that, you're basically a cheater because it gives you aimbot. I don't have any videos of it because I don't have one. And I'm not gonna go online to look up a video just to post it and do a commentary over it. The average time to kill for this gun is anywhere between with the Dead Eye set, if you have that, anywhere between 
2.5 seconds to 5.5 depending on the level and if they're elite enemies or not. Elite enemies generally take longer to kill because of the recent buffs they've gotten. They're, they're a lot stronger now than they used to be. They used to just be able to be melted. Now you really, I mean, let's go Kindle, get down. The heal, though, since we're doing it in the in-depth, can take down the enemy's armor in about three shots, if accurate, two to three. Headshots, you fuck off and die. The only reason I say, uh, wow, well, personally, I tell you not to run marching rifles, just because they are super fucking inaccurate. How'd this man get behind me? Tactical Link is my god! I mean, seriously, Ubisoft, please fix your sniping in this game. You could be aimed down sights and miss a hundred times before you hit them once. But that's just me. I don't know if it could be my accuracy, or it just could be the hit detection in this game. But I stick to full autos. That's my main build, is full autos, just because it's easy. I got the feel, and I was like, ooh, okay. This is for you, Miles. I know you're watching. And up we go. Appearances. Uh oh. I was like, where the hell is it giving me in it? I think for Star Wars. Dead Eye wasn't in Star Wars. There's no bounty on her name. Dead Eye. Oh my god. You get caught on one thing and you start running the other fucking way. Uh, Division, sometimes I like you and sometimes I don't, but most of the time I like you. It's just there's some stupid shit in this game that I wish they would have done differently, but you know what? I didn't make the game. So, I just play it. Ubisoft, I love your games. I'm gonna put that out there. I've played pro the majority of the games I have are Ubisoft, Assassin's Creed, Division, Rainbow Six Siege. You name it, I've, I've had I own it. Watch Dogs. Let's see how fast I can kill a bunch. Hachi boy. Oh, you don't like them headshot crit hits, do you? Stability would be nice, but you know, I don't have it. We broke. We broke out in this motherfucker. I don't have any stability mods. Oh, when the hell did you come out? Oh, I'm stuck! No! Fucking God, stop firing at me, you bitch. Oh, and you jumped down. Damn it. I wasn't trying to give him a jump. 100,000 hits, 72,000 for hits, 69,000. Come on. 
There we go. He's dead. Thank God. That was took longer than I wanted it to. But that's A-OK. -okay. It's one thing I really don't like about Marksman is you can't really rush. You could, but it's stupid too. And if you spray, you're just going to be inaccurate. If you really want a good weapon to use for your Marksman rifle or sniper rifle, use the Carbon M700. The bolt action is fairly decent. It does a hell of a lot more damage than this gun, just because I don't have the, the devil yet. So, if I get the devil, I'll be doing in depth on the devil. But, till then, I'm Rejuvenate. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, subscribe, and turn them notifications on. And I'll see y'all, you motherfuckers, in the next one. Peace.